Well, thank you uh, very much, uh, Jacqueline Wambiru. Indeed, we are in Busia County, and uh, what is happening is that we are keeping a keen eye on uh, the ongoing campaigns by Azmio Laumoja team. Of course, we all understand that ODM leader Raila Odinga is out of the country, but what has been going on has been the fact that uh, OD uh, ODM luminaries and, of course, other leaders allied to Azmio Laumoja have been do uh, do doing rounds across the country to popularize uh, uh, Raila Odinga's presidential bid even in his absence absence and today they are actually in Busia County and I'll quickly just uh, give you statistics that actually matter in uh, this uh, county and uh, this county has about 351 registered um, uh, 351,000 registered voters and of course cumulatively in western part of Kenya we have about 2.5 million registered voters and of course uh, that is of keen interest for politicians but of course uh, locals from this part of the, the world uh, will be keenly following what is actually uh, what is it that uh, these leaders will be coming here in Busia and of course all parts of the country to say and I'll just pull one of the locals here uh, so that then they get to tell us exactly what they expect from the leaders. Uh, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Uh, kindly uh, introduce yourself and tell us uh, why you're here. My name is Joy Shama. I am here to represent the young captains, the young generation very well we know for a fact that uh, uh, what brings politicians in this part of the country is about 2.5 million registered voters in the entire western part of the country as a resident of this region what are you looking up to these leaders to actually tell you and other kenyans uh, today we are here to drum support for the azimio caravan and i think that is what i will focus on as a resident of busia because uh, baba has the change that we want in busia at local level and as a country at large yes so we are just here to support uh, baba to support his 10 point manifesto and to say that we the youth are behind him and we believe we are safe in his hands yeah, just, just uh, uh winding up uh, what is it that you actually want from him apart from just supporting him because every other person uh, who has actually come here probably supporting them but what is it that you're looking up to him so that then uh, ultimately when he's elected he's going to help kenya as a youth and as a woman, I have two points I have picked from Baba's manifesto. The Inua Jami Pesam Fukoni is, is a point that is going to help uh, youth to give us a foundation so that we transform into what we want to become. Baba is giving us a foundation to be able to Kujikimu, Kujikuza Sisi Wenyewe. So uh, I know that Baba does not believe in handouts, and I am behind a leader who does not believe in giving youth handouts. Another point is uh, the Uchumi Kwa Kina Mama point. I believe that Baba is rolling out a plan that will increase wealth, that will increase uh, programs that support women in this country, and that is the leader we want. Fantastic, uh, Joy. Of course, uh, that is uh, Joy Sharma. Uh, she is the captain, the, she is the chairperson of young captains in Busia County, spelling out what she expects from uh, uh, Raila Amolo Odinga's presidency, but more importantly also calling on uh, those who support his bid to actually come out and continue to support uh, his bid. What I would want to tell you, Jackie, is that, um, uh, as I've said, uh, Raila Amolo Odinga will not be coming here today because we understand he's actually out of the country. However, his team is actually going around the country trying to drum up uh, support for his presidential bid. We know that from here, Malaba, he'll be heading to Busia Stadium and then of course uh, tomorrow in Megori County they will also be drumming up support uh, for him before actually going to Homa Bay County as they launch uh, the gubernatorial bid for Gladys uh, Wanga. Back to you Jackie Wambiru. Well that was our reporter Simon Achala.